greetings uh, and uh, congratulations to everyone uh, on this uh, on the 25th anniversary uh, of uh, ATRI. My association with ATRI goes back uh, a long way uh, when in early 2000 my wife and I visited uh, ATRI. At, ATRI at that time was a starter opera, start up operation um, uh, with very modest uh, uh, f um, rented facility, uh, but doing very good, uh, very good work. We were graciously received at that time uh, by uh, Gladwin Joseph, who was the director then, and also by Professor Uma Shankar, uh, who introduced himself as the co-founder of uh, ATRI. Uh, ATRI at that time, uh, uh, as I said, was uh, a, a very, very modest uh, operation. After return to the U.S., uh, I talked to, uh, uh, to Professor Bawa um, uh, a bit more on the finances, and I learned that it had no endowment, and, uh, uh, and uh, they were um, uh, operating uh, uh, the very, very modest operating budget. Uh, I, uh, at that time, I said, uh, uh, from where is the sustainability of ATRI uh, going to come? And then we decided that it would be good to have an endowment. And uh, we, uh, our foundation, uh, SM Sagal Foundation, uh, we committed uh, uh, some modest uh, money to initiate uh, the endowment. Uh, uh, and uh, now I am very pleased uh, that the endowment has grown into a uh, multi-million uh, dollars. Uh, and uh, that provides uh, uh, security, sustainability uh, to ATRI uh, during the lean years. Uh, Prior to visiting uh, Bangalore, uh, I heard good things about uh, uh, ATRI from, uh, from Dr. Peter Raymond of the Missouri Botanical Garden and Jim Miller, uh, who was heading uh, the uh, Department of Economic Botany at the, at the garden. Um, at the garden, we had established, uh, we were in the process of establishing William L. Brown Center uh, for Conservation uh, and uh, for Conservation of Natural Resources and uh, especially of Genetic Resources. Uh, the, uh, uh, on one occasion when I was, uh, when we were visiting uh, the Missouri Botanical Garden in connection with the William L. Brown Center, uh, uh, Professor uh, Ganesha from uh, Bangalore, from the University of Agriculture in Bangalore, uh, happened to be there. Uh, he came to discuss uh, uh, his project on flora of Karnataka uh, with Dr. Raven. Uh, he was accompanied uh, by a few of his other collaborators, and one was uh, Dr. Gandhi uh, from the Harvard uh, University Asa Gray Herbarium University, uh, Harvard University uh, in uh, Massachusetts. Uh, now I patiently listened to the discussions, uh, and uh, uh, during the discussion, uh, uh, it uh, they discussed the checklist project, and I didn't know what the checklist for, but at that time learned quite a bit that. Uh, uh, you know, there are so many names, and in every part of India, a plant has a different name, and uh, this need to be uh, compiled. And uh, I, I thought it was a fascinating project, and uh, we, uh, uh, you know, and, but they, they needed some funds, and our foundation, uh, again, committed some funds uh, to provide seed money to get the project going. On, 
this was a very good investment because now uh, it after two decades and a lot of work it became a all India project rather than just a Karnataka project and today uh, I understand five volumes of that uh, project uh, will be released or completed and two more volumes will be completed uh, shortly. All these 20 volume uh, or seven volumes will be online and uh, and it is a very good uh, uh, good that uh, this information becomes available to the public uh, because it is good for the uh, the country and uh, good for uh, people who are involved with the uh, biodiversity and environmental issues etc um, these uh, these couple of these uh, the uh, again it uh, uh, it started it had a humble start and uh, now it is a you know it a, it is a huge project and uh, which is uh, uh, being completed uh, we are very pleased that uh, uh, we have been associated uh, with this project from the very beginning and uh, and associated with ATRI from the very beginning. Uh, it is doing a wonderful job. Uh, it, as it is very evident from several honors which Professor uh, Baba has received and many, many awards which uh, ATRI has won. It uh, is a wonderful contribution to the society, to the country, uh, and I am very pleased that we are very have been a very small part of it. Enjoy again. Congratulations, congratulations for all the good work that you people do, and also on on the silver jubilee of uh, Atri.